Hi, I'm Del Mar. I'm a practicing pulmonologist in Sacramento for the last 30 years or so. During this time uh, in the treatment of asthma and lung disease, uh, we watch people give their cells inhaler treatments with uh, various things that we use nowadays. And it's been estimated that the majority uh, do never get this uh, medicine into their lungs effectively. Uh, so uh, we'd like to demonstrate uh, some of these uh, if we could today. Um, the important thing is, before you inhale any medicine, you have to empty out your lungs completely. So the first thing you have to do is blow out all the air, and then put the medicine in there. Suck it into the bottom of your lungs, and then you have to hold it for as long as you can, roughly half a minute or even a minute, to allow the medicine to absorb into the uh, bronchial tubes and uh, relax them and open them up. Uh, most people let it out too fast and it doesn't do them any good. This is an albuterol inhaler, which is a very um, normal um, uh, relief inhaler uh, for asthma, the first treatment. And then we have longer acting inhalers now. We have uh, the Advair inhaler uh, and some of the newer competitors. And these are easier to get into the lungs because you can't miss it if, with, by shooting it. So you have to open up this. Um, a container, uh, crack the uh, capsule, and the same way you have to empty your lungs completely. And suck it in. The medicine is now down to here, and you want to hold it there as long as you can to give that a chance to absorb and open up the bronchial tubes. And this one will last about 12 hours, where the previous ones are about four to six hours. Now we have a newer one that's primary for uh, emphysema, the um, Spireva inhaler. This is one where the capsule is put inside the little container here. You close it, you break the capsule, and you do it the same way. You blow, empty out your lungs so you can get medicine down into it, then suck it in. So the medicine is down here and you want to hold it uh, there for as long as you can, give the medicine a chance to work. This is a 24 hour drug, so things are getting more sophisticated and convenient for patients. That's um, basically what I'd like to cover for the day and we'll be covering more things uh, in YouTube as we go along and thank you for listening, stay tuned.